games now. He started off with a punter where he kind of knew where the ball was going to go. It's a mm -hmm. traditional style punter with good spiral. Kind of knew where it was going to go, and he was, you know, good, good to get his feet wet uh, with that, you know, because he knew where it was going to go. Then, then the next week was okay. Now you have a rugby punter, where it could go this way, it could go that way. You're not quite sure how deep, how how short, uh, you know. So he had two two games right away that were bang bang that were uh, that were two good tests for him, you know. And I think then going to the next week, now you, you play a guy that again in Iowa State where he can traditional spiral or he can roll out and in rugby, and I think you know he was able to take advantage of that. So I guess my point is with all that, that I think that um, I think you're only going to see him get better at that. I think you're only going to see him become more comfortable back there, making a decision and then and fielding, fielding balls and getting his hands on them and, and getting more confident returning the ball. Um, you know, I think that's that's what you're going to see coming up here uh, in the future. And I think I think I've, I've seen it myself in the last couple of weeks, you know, just week by week, he just gets more comfortable. And I think you guys have seen him at receiver and he does pretty well. He's good in traffic. and. He's got good hands and he's a trustworthy guy. Does he? I mean, but you picked him over Emir, so you must see something. Does he have that crowd Kyle Gronewig knack, or what? What do you see in him? Sure. You know, I, I think uh, not to compare him to a person, but I feel like he does have the ability to, to make a quick decision, and the, and he can run in traffic. You know, and so we went with him to for that, and Amir for kick returns, and you know, kind of see where it goes moving mm -hmm. forward. Mm -hmm.